come back. So coming into all fours, I just want you to take cat cow. So exhaling and inhaling, drawing the chest forward. Exhale, drawing the tummy muscles in and inhaling, releasing through the tummy and the chest. So with each exhale, we pull those tummy muscles up and in, opening up the back, inhaling, drawing the chest forward. Continue doing this, inhaling and exhaling. And then when you're ready, we're going to draw to neutral position, sinking the hips left and right, looking over the opposite shoulder. Inhaling, exhaling. Inhale, exhale. Good. Each time maybe getting a little bit deeper into those hips, finding what feels good here. Coming back into our neutral position, we're going to come back up into down dog, tucking the toes in, lifting the bottom up the height to the sky, pedaling through the knees and the hips. Obviously, if at any point any of these positions become uncomfortable or painful, come down into child's pose. Taking a couple more breaths here, inhaling and exhaling, ready to move into Chaturanga. You can either take Chaturanga or the option shown above. Inhale into Cobra. From here, taking a nice deep inhale, we're going to start to sink those hips left and right. So you're going to find some movement into the hips, moving one side and then into the other. Try to use your arms here and allow the hips to sink more and more into the mat as you move side to side. Take this gently, work with your back. From here we're just going to keep moving side to side and then we're going to take another nice deep inhale and move back into our tabletop from this tabletop position sitting upright encase the hands together and place inside the stomach and the thighs and roll down taking lots of nice deep breaths here so we're really looking to activate and move the digestive system so we're trying to get everything moving a little bit more kind of taking a nice massage into that tummy continue breathing deeply it may feel a little bit uncomfortable but just work with this from here you're going to take a nice deep inhale and slowly roll your body up we're going to take some lovely little twists side to side now try to keep the back up really tall if you are particularly painful in the tummy just work with what is going to allow your body to do inhaling and exhaling if you can trying to lift the chest up and over so we find a little bit more room into the tummy muscles from here we're going to be moving forward shortly into our tabletop so coming into tabletop we're going to take our toes back underneath and come up into our down dog again so rolling out into down dog taking a few little pedals if you wish to and then stepping the right foot to the outside of the right hand sweeping the right arm up to the sky finding that lovely little torso twist you can take the full twisted lunge if that feels comfortable otherwise drop the knee down take that top hand inside the thigh and then open up the chest looking up to the sky and coming onto the blade of the foot if you wish to step it back switching to the other side taking the left foot to the outside of the left hand inhale draw the left hand up to the sky tucking the toes in extending out for that twisted lunge if that feels good otherwise staying on the knee opening up the thigh coming into the blade of the foot release take the hands back down and we're going to come back all the way up to the top of our mat from here we're going to roll down onto our back and we're going to take it nice and gently so just really roll down take your time and then take a nice deep inhale and take the right knee into the chest releasing the left leg out this will just help with releasing any tension in the tummy take a nice deep inhale and then switch legs so taking the left leg into the tummy extending the right leg out inhaling and exhaling Finally, take both legs in and we're going to just take the hands behind the thighs and we're going to just take a nice deep inhale, exhaling. So we're taking this modified happy baby. Alternatively, you can take the full happy baby with peace fingers around the big toes, whatever feels good here for you today. Try to keep the tailbone down, make sure you're not rocking up. Take a nice deep inhale and exhale. Inhale, exhale allowing the tummy to really soften down from here we're just going to take the feet back down to the ground and we're going to sweep the knees left to right and with that we can also move the head in the opposite direction so we're going to do quite a few of these just to really 
motivate that digestive system to move a little bit more functionally than it has been perhaps and keep moving through sweeping side to side and then from here we're going to draw the knees up and sweep it all the way over and we're going to shortly just bring it across over to your left side looking over your right side and we're just going to wiggle that foot behind you so you're going to bring it so that the knee is in line with the hip and in line with the shoulder just hold it here taking a nice deep inhale and as you exhale softening down into the hips and releasing the thighs and if you get any sort of pains in the sides of your body this is such a good stretch really kind of opens everything out switching into the other side taking the left leg back opening up into the hip nice deep inhale exhale inhale Exhale. Inhale. Exhale. Draw those knees back up. Bring them into the chest. Give yourself a big hug. Releasing. Nice deep inhale. Exhale, softening down. And then slowly we're going to start to bring those feet all the way down to the ground inhaling and exhaling extending the legs out into shavasana taking the arms down alongside you taking a few deep breaths here now inhale and exhale inhale exhale inhale exhale and your next breath draw the right knee up and into the chest and the left knee and roll over onto your right hand side next inhale we're going to press down with the left hand and bring ourselves up to rise to seated from here take your hands to heart center bow your head thanking yourself today for this practice namaste